Welcome back, ladies and gents. On today's show, the Bentley blower roars again. New Hampshire legalizes flying cars and an update from SEMA. I'm Tiffany Stone, and this is Haggerty's Daily Driver. Let's buckle up. Twenty-four years after we cloned a sheep, Bentley is cloning one of its most famous cars, the 1929 Blower Bentley. Now that car won the 1929 24 Hours of Le Mans, and to honor it, the British company has created the Blower Continuation Series. And by honor, I mean sell for lots of money. Now Bentley is building 12 cars that will look exactly like the real one. Just like the original, the continuation cars will have a four and a half liter inline four that has a supercharger jutting out of the front. Honestly, look at that thing. It doesn't even look pedestrian friendly. A handmade aluminum body wraps around the chassis made of ash wood, which is all bolted to a heavy steel frame. And remember, it's not a replica, it's a continuation, meaning they never stopped making it. They just took like a 90-year coffee break or something. Now, Jaguar and Aston Martin have made a pretty penny selling continuations of cars like the XKSS and the DB4 Goldfinger, and Bentley wants a piece of that pie. It's a lucrative pie, too. Now, the blowers cost $2 million a piece, and all 12 have been sold. Moving on. New Hampshire has become the first state in the union to make it legal for flying cars to drive on public roads. Now, I know this sounds like an oxymoron. Cars, flying, road. Does a flying car ever need to drive on the road is the question. Well, the flying cars aren't allowed to use a public road as a runway, so they have to drive to a runway. I guess that's what makes them cars technically. Now, this bill would allow you to do that, provided your plane, I mean car, fits on the road, of course. Now, you would have to walk out of your house, hop into your car, drive to an airport, and then take off. That isn't quite what I think of when I hear flying car, but I guess it's cheaper than storing a plane at an airport. Now, speaking of the future of automotive trends, we have some bad news for you. SEMA 2020 is officially canceled. And I think I need to take a moment of silence for this. All right. Now, SEMA, which stands for Specialty Equipment Manufacturer Association, is not only the biggest car show each year, it is the biggest trade show in the country. Thousands of manufacturers gather to show off their cool new parts and project cars. It's the one show each year where people from every single corner of the automotive community gather in one place. From race cars to giant trucks, everyone comes to SEMA to show the world what they made. Now, the organizers were optimistic about the November show, hoping COVID-19 would be done ruining everything by then. But it's not, so they're playing it safe. In the meantime, SEMA has created a web page to help businesses find federal relief funds. But on the bright side, I know a lot of people spend their summer and fall cramming to get their SEMA cars done. Well, now you have an extra year to make it perfect. Coming up, we show you how you can participate in one of the best car events of the year from the comfort of your own car. But first. It is the year 2000, but where are the flying cars? I was promised flying cars. I don't see any flying cars. Why? 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 Because billions of people all over the world can work together on the web 24 hours a day, seven days a week. You don't need flying cars, but you will need a different kind of software. Every year at Pebble Beach Concord Elegance, Haggerty hosts a very memorable event, Dawn Patrol. People gather early in the morning to eat some donuts, drink some coffee, and check out the honored cars as they drive to the greens at Pebble. And of course, they get a hat. This year's live event was canceled, but Haggerty is hosting a virtual Dawn Patrol. On Sunday, August 16th, anytime between 6 and 10 a.m., regardless of your time zone, hop in your car, take a drive, and then when you stop, pull out your phone, take a selfie just like this. From there, post it to the Haggerty community, and you might get a chance to win your very own Haggerty Dawn Patrol cap. 